hey hello everyone I, in this video we are going to discuss about marker interface we know what is interface interface is contain method declarations no definitions and you can declare val declare variables there but what is marker interface marker interface nothing but it's a it's again a normal interface without any methods or no field for example in java we have our own uh, marker interfaces are available which is nothing but the famous one is serializable and clonable and remote interface we can see what is serializable clonable remote interface we can check it later let's create a simple example how the marker interface looks like and how we are going to implement it okay so before we start let's take a small example okay we have to take some real time example okay some real time example so what i'm going to do is um, uh okay i have a parking system i have a parking system okay so whoever has whoever uh, implemented my parking interface they are free to enter okay and whoever is not implemented my marker interface they are not allowed to enter you have to pay for it okay let's take a small example here okay let's take two wheeler and the another one is four wheeler okay okay to start with let's create a interface i'm going to create interface uh, parking okay as i said since it's a marking interface there will be no methods or fields okay it's just empty okay let's create a class class so the first class belongs to two wheeler okay i don't want to implement anything here just just copying that and creating another class for four wheeler okay let's save it so how we are going to achieve the marker interface how it is used actually basically it's trying to some kind of restriction if you if if you are if you are implementing my interface you have some privileges okay so it's a kind of setting some permissions or setting some additional functionalities to the object which is implementing the marker interface okay so what i'm going to do is here uh, i have two class one belongs to two wheeler another one belongs to four wheeler i'm going to implement only for the two wheeler okay it's pretty much simple okay okay now i'm going to create an object for that two wheeler two wheeler is equal to new two wheeler okay here is the deal how we are going to access it okay we need to check whether it is implementing my interface marker interface okay so we have to use the instance of either my two wheeler instance of my parking okay that means you are allowed to enter okay else you are not allowed okay so let's run this let's see what happen okay see you are allowed to enter because since my two wheeler is implementing my parking interface you are implementing my interface so you are free to enter okay in case i'm going to create a object for four wheeler let's see what is happening okay uh let's run this see what happened see you are not allowed to enter because it knows you are a third party class and you are not implementing my parking system so you are not allowed to enter you may need to pay this kind of restriction we can you can provide to the classes okay so what is the existing uh some existing interfaces which is a uh, uh, default uh, 
uh, marker interface which is available in Java. Uh, as I said, serializable and uh, clonable and remote interfaces. For example, if you're implementing serializable here, what does that mean? That means is you if you're implementing serializable, it is showing it, it's telling the JVM that this particular class is eligible for serializing because serializing is uh, when you are writing some objects here you can serialize it and uh, you can deserialize it those things it will be applicable only if you are implementing a serializable okay that's all from marker interface perspective just give it a try and see and try to make your own examples and uh, let me know if you have if you need any clarification or if you need any help um, and subscribe my channel thank you